take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. If you still can't get the splinter out, soak the skin around the splinter in a solution made with one tablespoon of baking soda mixed in one cup of warm water. Do this two times a day. After a few days, the splinter may work its way out. Once the splinter is removed, clean the wound by washing it with soap and water. Make your mark, take our lead. How to remove a splinter with vinegar. Since vinegar is acidic and can shrink the skin around the splinter, that will help draw the splinter to the surface. Using white vinegar or apple cider vinegar will both work for this method. Soak it for at least 10 to 15 minutes. Point two three March 2021. Make your mark, take our lead. The baking soda helps swell the skin and draw the splinter to the surface. Simply make a paste of baking soda and water, apply to the area, and cover with a bandage. After about 24 hours, the splinter should be sticking out enough that you can pull it out with tweezers. If not, repeat the process. Point 1 July 2014. Let's help you make your mark. Home care advice for minor slivers. Tiny, pain-free slivers. If superficial slivers are numerous, tiny, and pain-free, they can be left in. Eventually they will work their way out with normal shedding of the skin, or the body will reject them by forming a little pimple that will drain on its own. Point two one November 2015. Let's help you make your mark. These common methods for removing splinters may increase infection risk. Place a piece of eggshell lining over affected area. Soak the area in vinegar. Place banana skin on the area. Use baking soda paste on the area. Place a piece of potato skin on the affected area. The 28th of June 2017. Make your mark, take our lead. Cut a potato into thin slices. Place one slice on the splinter, use the side without the skin. Varying sources suggest leaving it on the spot for 10 to 20 minutes to the whole night. If you decide to leave it overnight, secure the potato slice with two bandages to keep it in place. Let's help you make your mark. If the entire splinter is embedded under the skin, you can use a small needle to remove it. First, sterilize the needle and a pair of tweezers using rubbing alcohol. Afterwards, look through a magnifying glass and use the needle to gently pierce the surface of the skin at one end of the splinter. Take our lead. Baking soda pulls up splinters cover the skin around the splinter with the paste. Then, put a bandage over the area and leave it alone for at least 24 hours. The baking soda solution should work to pull the splinter up to the surface, making it easier to pull out with tweezers easily and painlessly. Point one five October 2018. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.